everyone welcome back it's been so long since i've done a mukbang i am so sorry about that um i don't know if you can hear aiden he's right in the couch playing but yeah um it's been so long i truly apologize uh, i just been relaxing that's what's happening <laughs> so yeah as you guys know we just move so yeah i just been relaxing you know taking it easy um so today i have simple i only have the black muscle i have one snow crab because i'm not really that hungry but i wanted to make a video because it's been forever so yeah i have one snow crab potatoes well this oh sorry supposed to be like this but yeah i got potatoes here i have vinegar with this is seasoned vinegar by the way with salt and this is my fish sauce which i like um let's eat a little bit first before we start yapping i like my crab in the fish sauce i like that fish sauce can i say hi hi mm -hmm. We got two kitties. This is actually the first time that we have pets. So we did not adopt them. Well, we did not went to the pet store or anything like that to get kitties. One day they just show up here in the house and they never left. That's how we got them. They were still, um, they're babies, but they're not like, so 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 small you know mm. my baby you have some crab yeah like snow crab we just came home from the city we drove one half hour to go there it's hot mm, yummy And we ate. What did we eat there, Eden? Smoothie. I mean, shake. Mm. So, we love Chick fil A mm. strawberry milkshake. Every time we go to Chick fil A, that's all we're getting. Strawberry milkshake. It's perfect for a warm day. It's always warm here now. Well, as you know, we moved to South Carolina. From San Francisco, so it's mm. weather is nice. Mm. We love the weather here, by the way. A lot like Philippines, where I'm from. So we love it. Look at him, he's like a professional gamer. Are you a professional gamer? Yeah. Take a bite. Here. I asked them if they wanna do mukbang with me, but they don't. Since we just got home, it's already five. They haven't played all day, so they wanna play. This is so good. Hmm? So good. I'll give you guys an update <laughs> about my life. Mm. Since it's been forever. Thank you so much to the people who reach out and ask how I'm doing and everything like that. Thank you so much for your concern. We're all doing good. Just simply relaxing. Our life had has been so busy. 
especially living in California, it's like schedule is just like that, you know, one after the other. Um, when the pandemic hit, as you guys know, I was selling some masks and now I'm selling all kinds of stuff. But yeah, we got so much business from that that I was so busy. That's when I feel like I start feeling my mukbang. But I, you know, we do what we gotta do where we make money actually. So. <clears throat> Um, you know, life there in California is just like, it's busy, you know? Mm. And after moving here, life here in South Carolina is just way opposite in really good way. So people here are more relaxed and laid back. So, what are you doing? That's what I'm doing. I'm taking advantage of it. Bills here are just way so cheap. Well, of course, from California. California is just insane. The bills here is so cheap that, yeah, you can afford to lay back. You know, you can afford to take a break. Which is nothing wrong with that. And we've been enjoying it, yes. <laughs> we've been enjoying it. Oh my God, like I said, in the pandemic, we got so busy. We're still busy, but we can manage it. Now, our business is just right here in our property. We don't have to drive anywhere, you know? We don't have to go drive to go to the shop or anything we love it love it love it here mm -mm -mm. yeah mm -hmm. Oh my god, this crab is so good. We went to Costco today. Oh my god. I gotta tell you, in California, they got a lot of seafood. Way more affordable seafood than here. Before, well, I guess everywhere. Before, mm, I used to buy crab in Costco, king crab. So in the very beginning when I buy them, they were only $22 a pound. And then went to, I think it went to $26 a pound. But you have to remember king crab, one pound is probably just one leg. Cause their king crab is big. So it's getting expensive. You know how much is it now? It's insane. We look at it today. Now they're like $32 a pound. So basically $32 for one king crab leg. Here, get in. I did not get any because that's just way too much. And I feel like I've eaten, I've eaten a lot of king crab already that I'm like, I don't know. I guess for me, I enjoy the crab like this, that I, I'm picking the meat off the bones or whatever it is called. I like it that way, you know? And if I'm gonna spend that much money for a king crab leg, I might as well buy the whole king crab. It's probably more interesting too. And you get way so much. So yeah, seafood here is a lot more expensive. 
I gotta say they have a lot of um frozen snow crab. Yeah, frozen snow crab. They got a lot. And I'm able to buy his mussels, which I like. Hmm. This fish sauce, I'm telling you. You know what I use this fish sauce for? Okra, um, boiled okra, or steam. Green tomatoes, because I love green tomatoes. Just raw green tomatoes. Put them in there. Oh my god, so good. Remember, I t told you guys that I have a garden now. Since we moved here, we made a little garden. We harvest all the green tomatoes already. Well, I harvest some green tomatoes and most of them are ripe when we harvest them. Now I'm onto my second round of tomatoes. I plant them off the seeds from the tomato I got. And they're all growing they're so big now oh my gosh so how are you all doing i've done a lot of talking that's how long i haven't been in here Saving that for Aiden. I actually have more king crab, I mean snow crab. Yes, life is good. Really good, actually. My family, my kids and my husband, we moved in here on March. So we've been living here for what, four months? Four months, March, April, May, June, July, four months. I feel like we've lived here for forever. We adapt really fast and quick. It wasn't actually a lot hard, harder. To adapt, now we live in the countryside from living in the city, big city moving to countryside it wasn't a lot to adjust because me and my husband come from a small town so we don't come from the city that's why it's not hard for us to adjust and we love it people here are just way so nice You guys, check out my website. I got way so much stuff there now. I did, um, that website is newly done actually. Me and my husband did it. Um, I got a lot more stuff. I sell mostly um, leather, leather stuff, leather purse, pouch, um, keychains. I sell a lot of keychains. For men and women. 
Okay, there's so much stuff there. Check it out. You can personalize your item, which means you can add your name on it. Yes, I can add your name on, on the purse or any item you have. You buy. Which is a lot cooler. I actually like that. Yeah, check it out if you haven't done it already. And I would appreciate if you send me a message after you check it. You can use the code JESRI10 to get 10% off. Which I don't mind giving it to you guys. Yes. Yeah, check it out. Christmas is just around the corner. I'm so excited for Christmas, by the way. So excited. So excited to decorate the new house. Yes. And have a proper Christmas this time, you know? It's gonna be so fun. This is so good. I'm so sorry if I talk too much, but I haven't talked to you guys for forever. If you if you like vinegar, you gotta do this. When you buy vinegar in a gallon or half a gallon or whatever, if you don't like vinegar right right now, but if you do this, I guarantee you you're gonna love vinegar. That's what my husband's doing now. I swear to God, when we eat anything that we're able to dip vinegar where we have vinegar <laughs> guess what he would get a spoon and drink it <laughs> so in your gallon of vinegar or half gallon or whatever in the container chop up so for one gallon of vinegar chop up um one whole onion white onion and then you can put five to six cloves of garlic just smash it you know with your um knife just put them in there and then what else i put i put chili on mine but they don't really get spicy because i don't cut up the chili so basically if you have a long chili do not cut it up just put them in there put like 10 pieces of them they don't get spicy but you can it will make the vinegar really, really nice. Well, all the combination of the spices. And you can put a little ginger if you have one. Or you don't have to because sometimes ginger can give you the spicy effect. But yeah, onion, garlic, uh, chili. I think that's all I have in mine. That's it. And then just let it sit in there. Let it sit in there for like, let's say a week or a week or two, but you can try it in a week. I'm telling you, the flavor is way, way different, way seasoned, way tastier. Um, and then once that one whole gallon vinegar ran out, you buy another vinegar. You don't have to do all over again. You just pour it in the same, um, in the same container where the spices are. And it will season again. It's so good. Oh my god. Like for this, I just have that vinegar, seasoned vinegar, and I just put a little salt in it so it will get a little salty. Since this one has no 
No salt. It's so good, I'm telling you. You're gonna change how you think about vinegar. So good. If you try that at home, let me know and, and let me know how you like it because it's life changing, I'm telling you. I've known that way because that's how we grew up. We never used vinegar that is unseasoned or never been in that onion garlic base seasoning. It's so good. No wonder why the food at home are just so good. But yeah, my husband literally have a spoon with him every time we eat. And then dip his thing in and then eat it and then drink a little vinegar when we're done her, his lips will be all pale <laughs> mm. recently we just actually celebrate our 12 year 12 year anniversary yeah, so we've been married for 12 years. That's a long year. A long time. I'm telling you. I've always heard people say that in a relationship, you know, the longer it goes, the less interesting it is. We're not that way, actually. Ours is not that way. Um, I think because ours, the longer we go, I mean, we always get along since in the beginning. But right now, I feel like it's even even better yeah even better now i can literally know i literally know what he's thinking <laughs> so yeah we know each other very well and i feel like we like each other even more every day because I know we have some neighbor before that the longer the marriage is just getting ugly, you know. I'm so happy we're not that way. I think the reason is me and my husband. We have. We don't have separate lives, you know which we like actually we um we go everywhere together with the kids that's how we like it um we don't get each other into each other's nerve when we hang out or when we're together often we we like it i don't know i don't know if we're weird but we like it um guess what even if we're going to grocery store <laughs> All of us will be there. Everywhere we go, you can guarantee we'll all be there. But yeah, I think that's that's why we lasted this long. Um, everything is good between us. Because we do everything together. And we like it. Anyway, I talk so much. I enjoyed my food as you can see I feel like I eat it fast for me anyway um, the sauce is pretty awesome by the way I gotta go uh, thank you so much for watching I hope you enjoyed this video I am gonna try to have a vid video up for you guys every week I know I got work you know I have two kids I get kids oh let me tell you the kids here 
this is the first year they started school in mid-july which is crazy right yeah this is their first year starting school early i know in california they're still starting mid-august but here we started on the july 22nd I'm not so big fan of it but well in that way they started they started it early but they said that uh, uh, for thanksgiving instead of having three days we will have five days you know we we get more off throughout the year that's what they're saying well we'll see how's that gonna go but yeah busy busy schedule now every day <laughs> the end of the day i always like to go to the garden that's how i like to finish off my my day oh, i feel so satisfying but yeah that's the schedule here we love it so thank you so much for watching um I hope to see you guys next time. I hope you did not left me yet because I took forever. Um, yeah, I'm going to try to upload more videos for you guys. You guys take care. Uh, have a great summer. And I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.